Hello dear student, this is Dr. Sarah from DentaVest, your best online mentor for the preparation of IMBD, ADAT and AFK exam. Please like and subscribe to my channel on YouTube and follow me on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok and LinkedIn where I'm uploading and posting regular materials and important study facts related to IMBD, ADAT and AFK exams. Please do visit my website at dentabest.com to check different personalized and smart learning programs offered by me. So the topic of the video today is can we prepare for IMBD ADAT, ADAT AFK, IMBD AFK or all the three exams together? So the answer is yes. Why not? So to help with this question, I would like you to firstly understand what is the difference between all the three exams first and then we come to the similarities. So IMBD exam as we know is taken by uh, ADA, conducted by ADA, uh, where uh, IMBD is used to get admission into two years of dental schooling program, the DDS program for the American dental schools. While the ADAT exam, so IMBD is for United States. Now the ADAT exam it serves for both United States and Canada. ADAT exam is taken in United States for getting admission into master's program, your AEGD advanced education program or general practice residency program. Getting a high score in ADAT it helps you in getting admission into these advanced programs. Now, Canada from 2020 onwards, uh, 2022 onwards actually, have University of Toronto and McGill, they have started accepting, they were the first universities to start accepting the ADAT for getting admission into the DDS program, two years of advanced standing program in the Canadian dental schools. Now for AFK, AFK we know it is the first step towards equivalency to get a direct license to start practicing in Canada. So first you give AFK, then you appear for ACJ, NDAC, OSCE and then you get a provincial license to practice within the province. So these were the Differences between these three exams, INDD, ADAT, and AFK. And AFK, we know it's purely Canadian. Now, let us try to understand what are the similarities between three exams. So, INDD, ADAT, and AFK, the clinical foundation, it remains the same. So, when we talk about the clinical foundation, so what does it really mean to have the same clinical foundation? So, the clinical foundation. is this one right so that's where all the three programs exams are merging so clinical foundation involve preparing your clinical subjects right when it comes to endodontics pediatrics orthodontics oral pathology radiology diagnosis operative perio pharma prostho oral surgery public health right so these are the common clinical subjects that we prepare for all the three exams Difference definitely come in the question structure, right? Question formatting, right? So this is definitely the difference. So INBD, which is a two days exam, day one, day two, day one, you get 360 question, day two, you get case-based scenarios, 140 question. ADAT exam, which is a 200 question exam of four hour, 30 minute for 80 questions comes to biomedical, 80 comes to bio uh, clinical sciences and 40 questions come from biostat. Right, while AFK is your 200 questions exam, you have two booklets of 100 questions each for two hours each. So the clinical foundation, it remains the same. As I told you, the structure and formatting of the question will be different. However, IMBD exam and AFK, both are very clinically formatted exam. But when it comes to ADAT, as I told you, total 80 questions, they are coming from biomedical sciences and 80 questions come from the clinical. 
so biomed has the highest weightage when it comes to the adat exam so biomed we prepare human anatomy microbio pathology biochemistry physiology dental anatomy and occlusion plus in adat exam you also have bio statistics full 40 questions are going to come from here bio stats include your data interpretation analysis research methods evidence based dentistry right we have topics on ethics also epidemiology also although ethics epidemiology um some questions based on basic statistics are also asked in inbd and afk but not to that much of detail that you have for the adat exam so for inbd and afk right our preparation is very clinically formative but again between inbd and afk difference will be in the cl clinical structure questions the formatting of them and when it comes to biomedical sciences both for inbd and afk we can focus on although not many questions come from this uh, uh, section in both the exams but yes uh, we can focus more on uh, your head and neck anatomy right and then we can focus on histology oral histology your embryology tooth embryology yeah few questions can definitely come from here and dental anatomy and occlusion occlusion section especially remain important for all the three exam and occlusion section a major portion is also covered in the prosthodontics so this is the differences and the similarities between three exams and yes the answer is we can definitely prepare for all the three exams together the most important is to have smart preparation a high focus preparation that will always help you in acing all the three exams together thank you so much for watching my video study hard study smart and don't forget to subscribe for my channel like and follow my pages on instagram dentavest facebook tiktok and linkedin thank you all the best